Okay, everything's good to go. Yeah, I actually remembered to click the correct button this time. <sighs> Alright, what was I doing? Do I want to go back in there? I mean, I... Mm. I've thought it over, and I kind of want to go and get, like, all of the weapons, essentially. But if I wait... Like, this is gonna be a nut. Like, I did this before, and this is gonna be a really bouncy kind of thing. Stop the enemy. No. With him. Uh, where is he? Get over here. Oh, wait, I don't have to use him. Good. Excellent. Perfect. Um. Enemy merger stopping. I mean, you have 700 attack power. How dare you! Stupid emerging. Okay, that's taken care of. Let's go deal with this one the Dark Moblins. Stop body slamming the tiny little girl! Oh, great. Now I had him over half dead, and he decides to... Uh, 
Oh, God, Dark Evil. You know what? I'm, I'm just gonna... Him and I'm still gonna bring him in, because I need to. You know what I'm just a little bit bloodthirsty for? Just a little bit bloodthirsty. Like, I, I, I think I figured this out before and then forgot. Kill these guys! Like just a little bit pissed off. Get out of here. Get out of here. Be gone. Don't like this merging mission half the time. Although now that I've learned what I should be doing instead of what I was trying to do, might go better. Tired of the, the garbage and you just end the existence of everything. Oh, that's gonna be fun! Paint the shadow of the grotto, hmm. How's your badges looking? Nah, about as good as they're gonna be. What are you missing? Linkle's boots. You know, I really hadn't seen her in a very long time as far as that goes.
When was the last time I saw Scaled Summoners? <laughs> Story mode? Okay, who are we dealing with? Lizro. I hate this. No, don't do that. That's cheating. Sure, Volga's on the other side causing me issues. Use each captain's appear on the battle. Well, one of them is just going to be right in my way, isn't he? Just everywhere. Jesus. So the siege captain's up in my center one right there. Yeah. Well, let's go deal with that. Yeah, there's a lot of things here that need to die anyway. Nibley's in trouble. Well, I suppose that's probably Volga. I'll go deal with that in a second.
Deadly is in danger. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Stupid Volga trying to fry a chicken. I think that's gonna miss and not open up his weak point. Never mind. It's fine. Time is fine. Oh, that's not good. That's eminently not good. Okay, we'll take this key. Because I can. So I imagine ooh, what happened is the uh, one of those factions of units, or possibly both of them, got distracted by the key. I definitely don't want to be here. Kind of garbage. They took the other key, but now there's powerful units coming from it. This is probably one of the units that was going towards the, uh, one of the factions. Which means it's probably what the other faction is, which really pisses me off. Okay. Alright, let's go down the middle and take that center key. We'll take the other two. Just 
just because I knew that's exactly what was happening over there. Like, the, the, the strong aura units are over there, just ruining the other heaps. Go deal with that whole horde. Ugh. Hopefully they're held up up here. They look like they are. All right, cool. And I knew there was gonna be one of those. Get away from me with that. This guy needs to die. Especially this guy, because at least on the other side, there would be medley to kind of hold it off. What is taking side swipes at me? It's like I just see three hearts disappear as I hit through a horde of enemies that are shouldn't be hurting me. Okay, you are done. Thank you. It's like this stupid outpost, just so I don't have to deal with that anymore. Captains, they saw like, oh, they, they that's already taken, so they didn't get distracted. All right. There you are. Come here, buddy, boss. Then I gotta go to the other side. I guess we'll take care of the raid captains while we're over there. What I'm not going to take care of is the Gibdo that I think is standing right there waiting for the, the computer to be like, Hey, go attack the allied base. Nine distance I'm gonna look down the hallway and see a Gibdo. Well, that's a Lizalfos. Those are both Lizalfos. Okay, whatever. Where did I get a boomerang power up from? I didn't kill anything. Where are these random, like, weapon power-ups coming from? Ah, uh, I've already failed. It's actually been 13... Wow. It's like, one second it was five minutes, and then suddenly it's 15. Uh, 
I guess I'll take the heart container. And the levels. Time is definitely kind of what's gotten me on, like, all of these, like, the silver ones, weapon challenges. Or uh, this, like, the weapon challenges that are silver rank on this map. Because, like, I should be doing enough damage. Oh, he's right here? Okay, cool. Well, this gives me knowledge, at least. Knowledge in the heart container. This one's done, but the time is too not well, he's not done. It's like we're over time on this mission, unfortunately. There's stuff I can do to help, like, flex this up. Because, like, I otherwise have the level 4 weapons of everything. It, well, of everything that's on this map. It's the level 4 plus that I need. And there's a solution. I hate the solution, but there is a solution. Yeah, because, like, I even have her level 4 boots. Honestly, my best bet for doing a lot of this is just to pull out Lincoln and go murder. I 
there's one thing I can do to really boost up my power. Oh, magic troops. It's like, oh right, I'm supposed to be killing these guys. Here, even though that's the one I killed before. So like more weapons is more money, which can let me level up my character once I get other weapons set up. Like I managed to get around something that could help with Ruto and with Darunia. But I could just go do this with everyone. Probably that one up there. Yeah. We're going to be seeing a lot of Link of the Stream. Okay, good. Only one more path. <sighs> but it is something I could do. I could go here and I could go. Did I not see this before? I swear I should have. This might be an extra casual stream. Just like not really focusing on getting stuff. Not really focusing on like the forward momentum, but more like shoring up the back line.
Yeah, I do have to get the A rank, I think, still, so I, you know, that might make some of these take a while. Okay, Gary, I need you to get up here. Messenger's gonna get their job done, but I don't care about them. Gearheim, why are you held up? I hate the AI. It's like, oh, something has a health bar. I need to stop and focus on it. Gearheim, get in here and make the magic freaking circle. Let's go make sure gear him is fine. Okay, Gearheim, why are you still held up here? I mean, you know, I suppose if you want to be bloodthirsty, I got, I, I, I'm not against it. Okay, now the captain's over here. Honestly, between the enemies that are in, like, just clearing up some of these and the enemies I'll accidentally kill, uh, killing Zelda, yeah, I'm good. Like, it, this is just rush, rush to finish these. Rush to get A right. I have no need to do, to take any extra key. 
I don't need to do any extra mini thing. Don't need to stop those ambush troops. Because I beat Zelda and it's done. And then I just pray for good luck. I think I saw three stars. I wasn't looking. I could look. Yeah, let's see, like, that's just so much more power just right there. That's kind of why I'm like, let's do this. <clears throat> oh, dog. This is, uh, this is gonna be an interesting stream. This is a preparation stream. Yeah, I thought so. Wasn't worried. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just trying to do like some some back end work basically. I'm going to do the I kinda mentioned this last stream. You know, go back and redo the the missions for the level four weapons. Because you will always get a copy of that weapon from getting A rank, regardless of who you use. So that's what I'm doing here. Like, I'm just gonna go back and do the, the missions and hopefully get a three star or up. Because there's a big power difference. Like, an amazingly huge power difference. Like, a no- a zero-star level 4 weapon that has 500 attack power. Every star gives another 10%. So, a 5-star gives 750 power. So it's like, you know, that will really help. That'll really help in, like, all the other missions to, uh, do other things, just cause, like, you know, you feel faster. It goes better. Did you enjoy your Chinese now that I'm done, uh, explaining? I need to, uh, go find that somewhere. Actually, I don't want to find this somewhere. Do I want more chicken to summon? Summon chickens! Lots of chickens. Oh, good. I had a hodgepodge of stuff for dinner. Some spam, some ground beef, an orange cream cinnamon roll.
You know, another positive to just going back and doing this, like, going to try and get everyone a better weapon thing? I mean, from what I could see, it seems like it's gonna be... I can't believe I'm saying A little bit like that Wario game where you had those different... different versions of Wario who had different abilities. That's what it felt like. I've never played that game, but I've seen it, and it's like, you know, you have, like, different Warios, like Hero Wario, Detective Wario, you, you have su had stuff like that. It was a platformer for I don't know what system. Yeah, well, I never played it, so I couldn't know, but that's what it kind of fe felt like, looking at just some of the, um some of their like choices like you're going to go through stages that are focused around this power okay well I killed that guy that's all i cared about don't care about y'all it's like i just care about getting the a rank which means ko's and then kill yeah, well, one thing. Shit. Uh, one thing to know, we're probably getting a direct soon, and then we'll get. I'll uh, probably get more info. When? Don't know. But I feel like either like uh, soon, like in the next couple weeks soon. Okay, they've shown some gameplay to get an idea, and like I, on that front, yes. It's like it looks like the puzzly, like a more puzzly platformer where you have to use the different outfits to do different puzzles and platform around, and like and fight enemies. And it's like we don't have, we don't have enough information about the story. We don't have confirmation on what it looks like. Cause like you see, some, like gameplay, gameplay is gameplay, and gameplay can be interesting. But you want to know why you're doing things, not just this is here. And it's like if you if the gameplay doesn't seem interesting, then you the story might not make up enough for it for you to actually want to play it. Especially since you know that I will probably play it and you could just watch me for the story and not have to play it. I never killed the I did kill the summoner, huh? Don't recall doing that. I mean, really, the point of the game, like, the point of the game itself is probably they wanted to do another game where Peach is the main character after the, um, questionable de decisions of Peach's powers coming from a vibe scepter that can control her emotions and 
god if that hasn't been ripped up for all the innuendo. Jesus. You know, one thing it does kind of reflect, like, Snowy's opinion? Uh, Miyamoto's. Because, you know, like, you, I'm sure you've heard, like, the whole thing about Miyamoto's opinion is the gameplay is what's important and the story should be secondary, which it's entirely wrong. Like, I could sit here and play a million different versions of this game, but the one I'm going to like is the one that the story stands out. Three star. It's already got stars. Well, you're both wrong. It needs to have a good, like, a good balance. Not purely gameplay over story, not purely story over gameplay. There needs to be a good balance. Like, you can play, like, like I said, you can play a thousand games exactly like Mario. Like, you can play exactly, like, a thousand games exactly like Mario 1. You actually, you kind of actually really see that, that, like, the whole thing about, like, a thousand different games. Because every time something really hits it big, all the game designers go and rip it off. You know, like, World of Warcraft, hit it big. Guess what we got for the next, like, ten years? Things that are World of Warcraft, but with a different skin. You know, Breath of the Wild, really fucking big. Guess what? <laughs> Guess what's been trending? And there's been a million of those survival, like big open world games. People are still trying to make the next Pokemon after how many years? It's like, and that's where they're all failing. They're all just making, like, they're putting too much effort into the gameplay front. And not enough into, like, a unique story. Now, uh, gameplay and story need to be tied. Graphic, I will admit, is important, but that's just like, like not like the high-end graphics, just like graphic fidelity.
You know, this is probably comes down to, like, differences in, like, preferred games. It's like, a game doesn't need to look, get, like, be 10, 1080p, whatever, the or 4, 4K. Like, we don't need that graphics nonsense. We don't need just, like, everything has to be always be the absolute high res as possible. It just needs to look good. Well, that's why I said, like, it needs to be, like, tied. It's like, yes, it has to be fun to play. I can put, like, I've played games where, like, the whole thing is just the story. Because it's, the, like, the, that's what walking sims are. Or visual novels. It's like, walking sims, like, walking sims can be fun. I will 100% say that. But, at the same time, you're just kind of walking through the story. You may as well just be playing the movie. Most walking sims, at the very least, are smart enough to not overstay their welcome. They know, like, okay, we've got, like, three hours, maybe. I am so pissed off that one of those stupid manhandler stocks is all the way out here. Piss off! I mean, that, that's fair. Like, like I said, I, there has to be a tie between the two. They, like, they are both, uh, like, need to be number one, number two priority. And that should be a very close between them. You know what I'm kind of sad about? Since we were, like, since the whole thing that started this was a beach game. There's a game I know of. Uh, I think it's called Infinite Nikki. It's in the line of, like, Nikki games, which are kind of, like, fashion, fashion visual novel games. But one of them coming about is, like, a, kind of like a Breath of the Wild kind of thing. Where you're different, like, but, like, the fashion thing is jacked up. You know, like, the outfits in Breath of the Wild let you resist separate, different things or get different buffs. Like, Infinite Nikki is going to give... You know, like, get, in, Infinite Nikki is going to give, uh... Like, just jack it up. Like, this outfit lets you do this thing. This outfit lets you do this. And you have to make the different outfits. And I'm sad that the Peach game... Wow. How, has my just, has my voice been lagging, or is it just the and just the stream being a misbehaving piece of shit? Come on, there's no reason to be doing this except for Twitch being a piece of shit. It's like the chat's working just fine. Just the stream connection quality. <sighs> Gotta love it when the chat, when the stream just goes to shit because Twitch servers are absolute garbage. Ah. <sighs> 
<sighs> you know it's sad. I've seen like at, when you mentioned the lag, I I lean back. Oh wait, hold up. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna watch this. I there was a thing like the ad was about to start, and I'm sitting there watching it. Uh, it's like. Even the ad starting was lagging. So it's like, I'm going to watch this ad in progress thing, and when the ad in progress ends, if the connection tanks, I'm, I might just rage quit the stream. Well, yeah, because you're sucked. It's like, I'm watching the connection get better as the ad starts it's still kind of shit but it's not as shit as it was and i'm just gonna sit here and watch this timer and, be, and like if it goes to red i may <laughs> oh my god you piece of shit twitch connection <laughs> oh god I want, I was like, the ad's playing, the ad's almost done, and I see the, the connection just gradually starting to get worse, like, wow. Okay, yeah, let's give this a, minute, a second, let's, let's see the sad thing. I want to see if it just immediately tanks. Okay, the ad's done. Okay, anyway, what was I talking about? Infinite Nikki. So it looks like a Breath of the Wild type game, but like you have to get different outfits for different powers, like flight, swimming, uh, underwater, stuff like that. And you have to you know, collect the materials to craft the outfits. But unfortunately, because Peach game is going to come out much sooner, it's gonna get compared to that perhaps unfairly. Yeah, well, the stream seems to have recovered. We'll see how long that lasts. I didn't see how much stars that Sorcerer's Tome had. So I suppose we'll find out. Yeah, see, there's like an, exa an example of like, there's a lot of power. That's a five star level four weapon. I do the mission for a sorceress Sorceress Tome, and I get a one star. That just kinda sucks. You may cheer about this. I'm horribly tempted to just kinda take a two week break from High Warriors. Like, I, I like actually stop doing Hyrule Warriors right now and just like shift gears to playing something else and one of the things I was think like uh, thinking about um, doing was like just booting up the GBA advanced like the GBA NSO and just doing Mario and Luigi for the hell of it other thoughts included Majora's Mask um, Banjo Kazooie. Anyway, it's like you can say, you can say story like games are super successful, but let's get let, like as biased as hell as game of like the Game Awards is. 
Let's go look at what we can go look at what won. I mean, even just with Baldur's Gate 3. And we like and let's admit, like, that app probably actually earned it. Because that's outside of like that stereotype niche that uh Matt Pat had talked about. Because you aren't locked into old man dad. Like, one thing I will, uh, like, I'll admit, depending on the genre, story might not be as important, but it still needs to be, like, right up there, number two. Because, like, you're, like, you're running, you're jumping, you're doing platformers. But, and it's like, okay, when when it's done, what caused it to stand out? What makes you remember it? What makes it your favorite? It's like, we can, you can't exactly be like, well, Mario 3... Mario 3 is that old. Like, game design has evolved. Yeah, see it? Piss off. One, one thing I haven't gotten into when I'm, like, arguing this, I have not once said that the story has to be amazingly in-depth. I have said the story has to be good. No, no, no. He thinks it's, like, way less important than it is. I didn't say he hates it. He thinks it's way less important than it is. Like, trust me, I've seen, like, the whole thing about, yeah, this was a mistranslation. He doesn't really hate it. He just doesn't, like, he thinks gameplay should be, like, it takes a very big backseat to, uh, to gameplay. I'm saying they both need to be equal. Nintoku Chick fled. Here comes Mama Chicken, pissed off at me, and wants to murder me and me alone, despite the fact that these guys killed it. I know you haven't gotten any of the story of this game, because I haven't done it on stream. And I don't think you've played it yourself. But there is a, like, the story here is really great. It's, like, like it's not super in-depth. It's really good. Comes the freaking yellow missile of doom. Oh, look, we're gonna kill Mitha. I think I am. 
I think when I'm done with this mission, I'm just going to switch over to do something else. Like, I'm just, again, feeling, like, meh. <laughs> and understandably so. Considering how much I've done of playing this game. Let's see what the wep well, let's see what the stars of the weapon is that we just got. Two star. I mean, it's excellent. It's it's still like so much more power. It's like okay. When I started this, none of these were complete. And we started doing all of these. And these are the biggest ones. These are the ones that are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 16 by 8. And let's say, each, let's give each of them an average of eight minutes because i know there's some that like i finished really fast so it's like eight minutes time when 16 times eight okay this one has less i didn't think this one was smaller I mean, at least I'm being better than most people online, and just say, and not and saying like, not I'm not saying you are wrong. I'm saying I think this is how it should be. I'm going to do something stupid. This mode is unfortunately really bad. There's never any need to be like, and I'm right, you're wrong, unless like, this is like, unless I like, I have empirical evidence. Like, like if you were sitting there like trying to, to, to like, okay, that yeah, I, if I'm not, not not you, I'm just gonna say if I'm arguing with someone and they're like, flat Earth, it's like, you know, no, I'm saying you're wrong. Then, I will 110% say. You're wrong.
Uh, not fully, like I'm sure in my bit, like when I was doing a heavy emulation and bouncing around, just like whenever, when I was in like Schoolsville, I probably poked at, I, I'm, pro I'm relatively certain I poked at like Wario 4, you know, the advanced one. It's like I know I haven't beaten them really. I have taken up way too much damage for this. Cause this mode also has the um This mode also has the uh like the, the ranking system. You know, with the, uh, don't take this much damage. Then this is the winning, like, combo right there, the one that I'm doing. You just have to be careful of, like, these guys. We're playing as Ganon. This is like the giant boss Ganon. Yeah, he's like he has his own little side mode with his own little missions for him to do. So, like, unfortunately, you have to be really careful because, like, you're so big, you can take a, a chunk, a hit so easy. And it's like the moves that you normally uh, you, like use to weak point, like to get his weak point open. If you defeat the giant boss in question, like you know, I I picked up that what looked like a little statue of the uh, main handler. And now I can do this. You see, I just took a massive chunk of damage from something I can't even see. See, I wouldn't be surprised if, like, one thing Nintendo is thinking ab about with, like, the new console is just, like, a kind of a, 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 a renaissance. Like, bring back everything. Give a new game to everything.
Because, like, that would be a good decision. Well, see, like, sequel is fine. I'm just talking, like, bringing back every one of their series. Every one of their ideas. It's like, see what modern audiences like now. So like we like everyone knows like the like the like the the Zeldas are gonna go well, Mario's gonna go well. Star Fox hasn't had a lot, like there's its niche fans, but it doesn't re like it hadn't really had a a good recent game. I mean, I'm sure, like, uh, there'd probably be a lot of people who would just love a, like, uh, like, uh, a game focused on just, like, Peach, Daisy, Rosalina, and, uh, uh, Pauline, maybe? It's like, Mario is missing. On, on, like, uh, just, like, a this is probably a fun reason to just play as Peach. Would it be exactly that? That then that may well be what they uh, did with the Peach game. still alive. Never mind. <laughs> it spoke too soon. It's like this is a big hard mission. And it's like you don't even get like a you don't get a um Like, you don't get access to, the like, the bazaar to level up Ganon. You could only level up Ganon from the... from, like, just doing stuff. At least I don't think. Yeah. So like do like if I include this as part of that hundred percent thing, this is going to suck. Check combos. Anyway, let's go poke around these. Like let's just go poke them in general, see if there's anything of interest. Oh, great. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's 
See, that's one I know I played and beat, like, back during the the emulation uh, golden age, when, like, you could get a hold of any game the day after it came out. Or at least uh, you could get a hold of any GBA game the day after it came out. And you will forever be wondering. And like the one thing you gotta know is like G the GBA heyday was like two thousand two or so. Ah, oh, Yoshi story. Hmm. So, like, the GBA was, uh... God, how many years did that have? Because, like, the DS was, like... I want to say, like, 2006? Hello, cat. Okay. That's like, you know, like just looking at in, like the N64 online. N64 Game Boy Color. GameCube GBA. And then that's what like, and they're like, we have Wii and DS and that's kind of where they started splitting. And there really isn't a lot in here, is there? Jesus. Like, for probably being one of the things that they really- like, there was so many games released on it. I have a website that I check periodically that's like just the big list of randomizers, see if there's anything interesting that comes out. There's a randomizer for this game. I don't know what the hell it's about. It looks... I don't know. But, you know... Yeah, I get that. Okay, I'm assuming you're on the side of uh, of uh, this game. So, call heads or tails. It, like, whichever one you call will be this, and then the other one will be Banjo-Kazooie. I'm going to coin flip up, ready to click. Yeah, but like, which one's heads? Which, what, like, do you call heads or tails? <sighs> okay. Flippy. Well, guess we're going to go to Banjo. Landed on tails. Board of
Let me change the title, change the game. Oh god, I've got the stupid glitch. And I hope you enjoyed that little, like, that little disappointment of me trolling. Anyway, if it, the glitch I'm talking about, um... Uh, on my side, on OBS, it says the game is Hyrule Warrior still, but Twitch I know is displaying it properly. Well, I don't know that. Like that smile, I would just not trust it ever. Was this before or after the, uh... Was this before or after the, um... Blah, 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 uh... The SP? After? Like, the colors, it feel a bit bright. And like that, like that's a just a consequence of when games are developed, because like you, you know, uh, what was that? What did I think? Um, Metroid Fusion is a good example, because you know that was developed for the original GBA and not the SP, so the backlit wasn't expected, so everything was designed a bit brighter and darker at the same time. Whereas, like, games with the, that were developed after the SP, they had, like, a different graphics kind of philosophy because of, like, expecting the backlight. Even though it was, uh, right on the wing. Did, did I forget about Ashley coming in? You know, those things I just did. Up, go away. Before we go play a game of Punt the Toad. It's like freaking tutorial NPCs. Get the hell away from me. be honest if <laughs> is it lagging or is it lying to me but anyway gonna be honest if if I knew that my saying things cause things to blow up I would not try 
probably be li liable to be sued. Especially if the more things I said caused more explosions. Nah, I think I'm good on not talking to everybody. Thank you. Yeah, I know it's lagging. I've seen it. I've noticed. I see it down there. It's just like... Hmm? Now why can't we do that normally? Like why can't we do the uh, the spin normally? Twitch decides to be a piece of shit. I'm standing on nothing. Wait for the connection to try and fix itself. Ugh. Come on, Twitch, get your shit together, please. next time. I'm gonna remember that one for next time. Okay, connection's fixed. Connection is fixed for now. Yeah, hi Luigi. Get away from me. No. I don't care about any of these tutorials. Luigi, stop getting in my way. Playtime's already been artificially inflated by five minutes waiting for Ch Twitch to get their shit. Luigi? I need to walk, which means you need to get the hell out of the way. Some 
blending. Yay, money! That's higher than he can normally jump. Bye bye. You know, that's gotta be worrying for the guards. It's like, oh, well, here comes a whole bunch of minions just going into town. Yeah, I'm sure that wasn't uh, the intended use of that hand. I'm sure the intended use of that hand was for Peach. saving just because I can. I sincerely doubt that I will die <laughs> this early. At least not unless I find some broken enemy. I'm sure that will not help anyone at all, ever. Because it amuses me. Passports again? I thought we were entering illegally. I mean, we are on the flying airship of someone evil. terrified of getting his picture taken. Wonder if they've run into the camera obscura. Although I think Luigi would like that. Egad probably would. It's like the camera obscura? Hmm.
nice and ready. Nah. Don't need it. D didn't I tell you I don't need it? Get away from me. I've played this game before and beat it. It's just been a while. Poor Goombas being rounded up. Well, I suppose it did get me a level up. Might make things easy. No. No. I refuse. I refuse. It's not predetermined. I know this crap enough. You know, I'll accept it too. Did I not? Excuse you. Ho hold on, hold on. Did that? That I also refuse. Yeah, there we go. I don't know why they're putting the Goombas in the barrels. Hope they're being uh, taught better. Or Luigi.
Yeah, that's kind of something like what happens when they're pups. <sighs> Twitch, 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 why are your servers so shit? You know what, I'm not waiting. I, I don't feel like waiting. I'm, I get bored. It's like, I can't make Twitch fix their goddamn servers. Although I can try and change the server that I'm connected to. It's been otherwise fine. Bowser. Scream warping powers. Nah, I'm good. completely disconnected. Oh. 